A stipulated judgment between the California Department of Justice, the City of Bakersfield, and the BPD last year was the result of an investigation into the police department following serious concerns raised by the community about some police practices. On Tuesday, community members and Bakersfield monitoring team representatives spoke about those concerns with the department. 23ABC's Taylor Levesque has more on their discussion. The four major topics of discussion at Tuesday's meeting were as follows. Does the Bakersfield Police Department deliver police services in a way that you expect? What are your expectations for police service from the Bakersfield Police Department? What can the Bakersfield Police Department do to improve the relationship with the community? And what can the monitoring team do to keep you informed to make sure that your views are represented as we go through this process? A range of the community's concerns regarding BPD were identified. Excessive force uh, to um, you know, alternative to incarceration services. These concerns, plus harassment, unlawful stops and searches, and the lack of language accessibility and really trying to understand who they're serving, were dozens discussed and noted by the Bakersfield monitoring team, which is responsible for making sure the city and the Bakersfield Police Department is in compliance with the requirements within the five year stipulated judgment, including engaging in actions to protect individuals' statutory and constitutional rights, promote public safety and treat individuals with dignity and respect. What we've found so far is that the department is amenable to implementing the reforms that it agreed to and we are able to bring that experience and frankly as an independent third party provide recommendations, technical assistance or even looking at what are some of the issues raised by the community and making sure that the metrics under the agreement um, have been met. They also have the ability to advocate on behalf of the community. Regularly our, our employees are at risk of danger from outside issues um, and we don't get the support that we need and that's typically the answers that they're given. Community advocate Andres Zuniga says he is grateful that community members' voices are being heard. We have to start somewhere. It's going to be a long process here in Bakersfield since we've been experiencing these injustices for so many decades. Other community advocates like Reina Rodriguez says she believes the monitoring team can help initiate change. It has to be a desired change from both sides, not just one side. Community definitely, I, I can see that they want to change. Otherwise, you wouldn't have community voluntarily coming here for a two hour session to talk about these issues. Kirby says during this first year of judgment, the team will focus on use of force. The judgment ends upon compliance with the requirements, which is determined to be met by the Bakersfield monitor team. The team will continue to conduct audits, assessments, and listen to community members' opinions, ideas, and goals. The next community meeting is Wednesday night at 6 p.m. at the Silver Creek Community Room. In studio, Taylor Levesque, 23 ABC, connecting you.